I'm sad. Hey my loves, it's your girl Tanique Ramon, T-I-N-E-K-E, -E. don't forget the dash, I-M-A-N. So today's video is kind of inspired by um, a lot of things. The first one is this damn corona child, you know, quarantine, we are in the house. So that means I got time to film, so that's a good thing. Um, the second thing is, because I am in the house and um, because this corona is uh, everywhere, you know, everywhere you look is corona, corona, you know, getting the vibes low. So doing makeup just, you know, makes me happy. It's a bit of makeup therapy for me and it could be for you as well, just to watch me, a bit of therapy. Um, it's also, I wanted to try, um, it's like the one layer of makeup. So literally all you do is put, you put all your makeup on at the same time. So instead of doing like foundation, then your concealer and then your contour, you actually put it all on at one time and blend it out. So I'm going to try that. And the last thing, you know how everyone's doing this Megan Savage challenge. I have done it multiple times. Follow me on TikTok, at Nixie. Um, It's my nickname. But. I thought let me do a Megan makeup challenge because Megan um, likes to say her makeup herself and she loves to do a cut crease and I don't do cut creases that much so I thought let me do a makeup look so I'm gonna be doing a mixture of these two looks they're kind of the same ish um, but let me just get it up on my phone so that I can see but I will try and you know put it up but if I don't so this is one of them so if you see she likes to do like a cut crease and then the second one you have to like zoom in um if you can see it if you want to focus on that but yeah there's my good sis so we're gonna try and do a megan neutral cut crease so let's get started enough of me talking so my eyebrows are done and my eyes are set and i'm going to take my morphe 35 m boss mood palette um i use this one a lot and we are going to use um if i can Listen, I wish I just put these under the shadows because now I've got to line it up and try and find what it's called and even get it the right way and I've dropped a brush, I'm a mess. Hold on. So I'm going to use Talk Dirty, so it's like a brown colour and I'm going to put that into my crease area and fan that out. So we're going to put it into the inner corner. Yes, mother. Sorry, child. Um, so, yeah, I just put it in and I'm just patting it and fanning it out. Let me bring y'all in. And if you hear my sister in the background, I apologise. Obviously, she's at home. I don't know what she's trying to do right now. But, yeah. And I'm just going to brush that out. Let me just have a look if she has, like, a transition colour. So, she has, like, a reddish transition colour. So, before I blend this out, I'm going to just get another brush. If I can find one... And I'm going to use Vampy Vixen. So it's like a, um, I don't know what it is, but you'll see it. I'm going to put that just on top of it. Like that. And then that's it. And then I'm just going to blend that out. So after I've done that, then she does cuts the crease. So let me go ahead. I'm going to use my NARS concealer in chestnut. And it's like a flick. She like flicks it up. So like that. And I'm about to do that. While this dries, I'm going to do it on the other side. So bear with me. 
So we are here. This is the point we is at. So after I have cut my crease, I'm then going to use um, just like a, it's a flat, a flattish, densey-ish brush if it wants a thing. I just use it concealed on the other side. So I'm going to use this side and just to set this look because her eye look it kind of it's kind of like a concealer look um, and then she like sets it so i'm going to use it's called light of the party i think yeah we're gonna use light of the party just to literally set this look just to put it on top because i still want that concealer look mm. maybe not so instead, I'm actually going to use my Morphe 39L behind the lights palette and I'm going to use my type. That's my type. That's my type. Yes, this is more like it. You can't even see me. Sorry, dolls. Because I literally wanted, I think the other colour was too light. I wanted a colour that was exactly the same colour as my concealer, basically. And this is so... And that is my eyeshadow for now. And we're going to come back to it after the face. Okay? Okay. Let me bring y'all out. For my primer, I'm going to use my Milk Hydro Grip. I'm trying to think about where to start with this one layer of makeup. I think if I just start from the inside and go out. So let's start with my concealer, honey. I need my mocha from Too Faced. I need some more. If we do that, same old ish, you know. So we put that in that area. We're well, gonna do a little bit under. Um, and then the rest I do is foundation. So we're gonna use my NARS foundation in girl, can you get it right? My NARS foundation. This is in not about to say Macau, but it's not, it's Mo Moera, Moera, Maria, medium dark 2.3. That's what it's in. Let me do that in that area. This area. Like a little bit there. And then the gaps. So... Thumbnail. Um, and I guess you just start blending out. We'll see how this goes. So, as I have a foundation brush, I'll start that now. So this is all supposed to obviously make it feel lighter when you wear makeup. This is very awkward. Let me try a sponge. <gasps> See, I knew this wasn't going to work. Like, I use different sponges, so I'm kind of going around my contour um, I'm gonna go with a different sponge to do my contour this bit looks patchy it looks patchy I don't know if I like doing it like this oh my days look at this rim oh I'm not sure how I feel about doing it like this. It's very complicated. Like, I don't know if I have time to blend it out. Like, I'm not saying it's coming out bad, but apart from this contour, which I don't know if you can see it in the hair, but in the mirror, it just looks a bit patchy. Um, I'm just gonna go under my eyes, make it a little bit lighter. Should really be looking at the picture to see how Meg does it, but. <laughs> I'm gonna do this anyway. This is the only extra second layer I'm doing. Everything else is one layer. Okay. 
So this I guess is the one layer of makeup. This is how it's come out, just the base. Let me go ahead and set it and all that and I'll be back. Okay, before I take this powder off, um, I looked at the picture again. She does have a little bit on her under eye. So I'm going to use just my Fenty small detailed brush. Um, pre precision, precision brush in brush 2020. <sighs> I can't read. Brush 220 because 2020 is cancelled right now. But I'm going to use back into my boss mood palette and i'm gonna use something just a slightly bit dark lighter than what i did it's gonna be let me see if i can read today peachy keen i'm gonna go with that first and just put that on my under eye oh i like that Girl, I like that. Oh, girl, I like that. I like that a lot. I haven't done an under eye um, shadow for ages. I used to all the time. Just look, ooh. I might have to go back to doing actually under my eye because I like this. We'll just brush off. I'm dropping everything. I'm just gonna brush off this makeup, this powder this if I can find my right brush and I'm just gonna put that bronzer on now it feels to me it kind of feels the same it's supposed to feel lighter I don't know if I did it right but to me it just feels, it feels the same I understand how it's supposed to feel lighter because it's not layers but so next she has her lashes and eyeliner. I'm gonna do that, fix my hair, and come back for the lips. Guys, guys, do you see what I see? Side note, shout out to Beck, so divine salon for my hair. You know, this is so divine hair, so divine wig, and she so divine installed it she did everything um so yes yeah, so shout out to her um but yeah guys do you see what i see like do you see it all um i'm gonna do my lips i don't think she actually has highlight on let me just double check um no she doesn't really have highlight on she just has lips so for the lips, she just does like liner and then a clear gloss. So this is my MYX Coco Liner. So I'm just gonna line my lips. So kind of like that. And then I'm gonna use my Fenty Gloss Slipper Clear Gloss. And just outline, not outline. Just put it on my lips. And then set my face with my Morphe, you know, this. And we're going to dry her out. And honey, she is done. She is finished. Call me Tanika the Stallion, honey. Um, well, I can't really be a Stallion because I ain't tall. I'm small, you know, about 5'2", five 5'3", five but it doesn't matter. So this is my Megan the Stallion look. And I did makeup to do what? Nothing. I better see if I can quickly go out on these streets and find something to take these nails off because um, all shop, my nail shop is shut, everything is shut. So I need to take these off myself because otherwise they're going to grow out and look ratchet, honey. But I'm a savage. What? Classy, bougie, ratchet. Sassy, moody, nasty. Acting stupid. What's happening? What's happening? I'm a savage. Yeah. <laughs> So 
but yeah so i hope you enjoyed this video girl i really like this look like i'm about to go on the street like this and i don't care if anyone looks at me and subscribe make sure you subscribe you've got nothing else to do right now everyone's on lockdown so subscribe to my damn channel okay next video right here and subscribe right here peace yeah. i'm that bitch yeah. been that bitch still that bitch will forever be that bitch, forever be that bitch. <laughs>